What is going on BHV? As you can see, we're back at Goofy Golf. We had so much fun playing the first course. We're going over, I think this is actually considered course number one. We played course number two last time. We're back today. We're gonna check out the other side. I'm so excited. I'm excited for this. This was such a fun course to play before. I cannot wait to see what this side has in store. So, place your bets in the comments down below. You think I'm gonna win? You think Alicia's gonna win? You think that helicopter's gonna fly over us right now? Hey, helicopter. You ready? Yeah. This is gonna be fun. All right, hole number one. I like it. We got a gator. That's very fitting for Florida. So I guess we so just hit it in its mouth. You can either it hit it in its out. mouth or it rolls down. Did it come out of its tail, I guess? It comes I guess out. It comes out of its butt right there. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, probably like right there. Cool. Okay. This place is so much fun. Right in. All right, so let's see where he comes out at. If I can get it in time. Not bad. It came out of his butt. I'll see if I can get in the gator's mouth too. Tried it. Just enough. <laughs> Just barely. Wow, mine came out faster and farther than yours. All right. Two for both of us. All right, see where the next one's gonna lead us. We're going to the nice, uh, this is kind of like a palm tree setup? I dig it. Oh, we got a castle. And we got a creepy, whoa, and there's a, okay. So that moat goes up and down. And there's a hole back there. That dude's guarding it. I'm guessing it goes way back here. Is that how this works? So if it goes in the moat, like you got a long ways to come around. There's the hole, yeah. Yeah, it comes out the back. So you really want to get it in that moat. Otherwise you're in a lot of trouble. All right, let's see if I can get in the drawbridge. Please, right in. It banged around a lot in there, so we'll see how quickly it comes out. It's already out. Oh, wow, that was fast. Hey, it's definitely better than going that way, that's for sure. Can she get it in? Yep. All right, let's see if I can get back there before it comes out. Oh, maybe. Is that a little more oomph it would have kept going? That was close. Two. We got that J.J. Abrams lens flares going on right now. All right, what we got next? Oh, we got a, is that a turtle or a snail? A snail. Wait, this is cool. So you got a hole right here. Or you or get the it all the way shot. up. That's awesome. But I guess, yeah, then, I guess one comes out under her neck and then the okay. other right here. I'm a, it's She's gotta cute. be the, <laughs> that's actually a really cool idea. This is definitely gonna be one, like, I don't know how hard you're gonna have to hit this to get it to go in there. That's a warm-up swings. That's an that extra warm. That was a good warm-up swing, babe. <laughs> See what that can do. Oh, that's right good on. for me. Hey, still. I thought it was coming out a lot straighter, but it curved to the right. It's or good for left. Me. He's like, you want to hit it really hard, but I don't want to send it flying. <laughs> well, that didn't work. <laughs> Did it go in? Oh yeah. It like. It got like to about right here when it hit the corner and just like bounced around a bunch and then went down. So, no middle hole for us. Two. All right. All right, what we got for hole number? Oh, we got a classic windmill. I don't think I've ever played a course that had a working windmill. Like, ever. This is like the classic mini golf shot. Nice. This is like so classic right now. I love this. Let's see what happens. Like I'm genuinely curious. It's rolling around in there. Sits. There it comes. Come on. Tech, oh! Yeah. Hole in one on the classic windmill hole. Let's go. I like the fact that it's slow bringing yeah, the thing around. Yeah, it's not around. like, yeah. So you don't have to like rush. Oh, for sure. To get it in there. It's rolling around in there. If it gets stuck up against that stick. Oh, there it goes. Maybe. Oh, right by it. Yeah, I do appreciate that it's not like flying fast, so you don't have to rush your shot. But it's just there like almost just for looks, and I appreciate that more than anything else. That took a curve. I started to do what they said. Well, okay, this looks interesting. So it's on a pirate ship. Oh, and the hole's just straight down. But it's a simple shot, it's just down the stairs. But I guess I could just roll around possibly. Huh, that's cool. Okay, actually, Alicia, here, I'm gonna go up here. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, steer the ship while you hit. Does it actually spin? Oh my god, and it moves. This is amazing. 
Let's see. It might. Very nice. Hole in one for Alicia. Nice. Be a good captain, I got it Alicia. On the au autopilot. For a second there, I thought I was just gonna sit on the edge. You're a good captain. I applaud you. I applaud you. It was on autopilot. It was on autopilot. All right, hole number six. We got a dude with an ant on his face. So. Holes right here. Holes right here. That's you actually. Just don't want to roll back here. Oh, because you're going to have to hit it back up if it does. And then it comes out and then the hole's down here. Okay. Will it make it? it gets Aww, I was afraid that was going to happen. We'll keep it going. Okay. Can she get it in? Yep, yours is the exact same thing. Give it a little. We'll see. Ain't coming. Brax. Hi. Sorry. Three's for both of us. What's up next for us? Okay, I see a bunch of pipes. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four options, five options. I think they all come out right here, though. Okay. So. This, this is going to be interesting. I guess whatever happens is going to happen. I will say this, though, because I noticed this. There's a pipe right there. Oh. So something comes one of them back. Come back. Something comes back, and I don't know which one it is. Oh, I guess we get to find out. You're the test subject on this one, babe. Let's see what she gets. It's coming back. I can, yeah. No, oh, it's no, not. it didn't. Is that it? Oh, no. These holes are not yours. Okay, so it's one of the, uh, it's at least the far left hole. Yours would be one of the slits, I think, right? I think so. Please? Please don't come back this way. I hear it. I don't. Up. Oh. <laughs> it went back in the hole. I lost my golf ball. It came back. <laughs> we'll get, you can go ahead, I'll figure mine out. It turned. That is on actually a little hill. Didn't realize it was on a hill. Well, Three for Alicia. Three. That won't hard enough. Four. I like how Turtle one. I noticed this afterwards, guys. So look, where mine came back, I was wrong. All of these, all five of them, come down this pipe. There's a hole right here if it rolls too hard that brought it all the way back. I managed to get it in that one. Okay. All right, so let's see what we've got next. We gotta hit through the little hut. We got a bridge that can either roll down if it doesn't. Okay, the hole's just on the back side. Okay. Uh oh. Maybe. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> You've got cursed all of it. That time. was so close to making it through. That makes me nervous, though. Well, I'm gonna leave it there. Maybe you'll somehow hit that out. If not, then that is an unfortunate spot to be stuck. This makes me nervous. Is it gonna hit mine? Mine went under the bridge. Yours went under, but yours came out. <laughs> At least yours came out. Here, well here's my stroke too. I'm gonna actually see if I can hit it up it. If I just roll back. Nope, that didn't work. Okay. And then it, oh, okay, it came out right, at least. There. Barely, but it came out. That was pretty close. Three Let's for Alicia. All right, now I gotta figure this out. Well, I'm gonna have to hit it right-handed. Get it over there. Launch it. Oh, that was actually close. And four for me. All right, so we're on the backside of a giant like Easter Island head. This is actually pretty cool. There's a lot of names in here. Hey, represent. Hi, hi parents, hi family. So you can hit it all the way up and then the holes back here. Wait, there's a staircase. We're gonna come back to the staircase in a minute. This is cool. But yeah, we're on the giant, like, well, nostrils of an Easter Island head. Just enough. Actually, take that. Maybe? Oh. Not too bad. 
I scraped Very my nice. Phone, so it made me nervous. Oh, really? Yeah. It worked for you, though. Come on. Woo. Two for both of us. But now that we finished this one, you want to see where that staircase beside him goes? Sure. Now let's go try to discover what in the world this giant staircase leads to. It's not a very wide thing, but it's set up like it's not blocked off. But oh, you really have to watch your head. I'm not wearing a hat. You know, I'm probably going to end up hitting my head because I can't see. Okay, now we have a little bit more of it. This is. I've definitely never been to a mini golf course where this is part of it. This is making me nervous. <laughs> I think we're at his nose. I think that's his nostril right there. I think there. my fear of heights is starting to kick in. <laughs> that is awesome. Wow. Look at that. Can you ever say you've been in a mini golf course and you could do this? No. That's pretty cool. This is pretty cool. And look, the beach is right there. And a crane. I see it. And a crane. And a kite. And there's like an awesome overview of the entire property. That is so cool. And you have like a bench here, like you can just like sit down and relax, I guess. That's awesome. All right, time to head back down. Whew, this is definitely steep, that is for sure. Definitely never seen anything like this ever on a mini golf course. I mean, you guys heard what we said last time, like all the way, this is the tiny little gap right here. What we said last time when we played the uh, course two, the first video we did here. Oh, I got a duck. Oh boy, okay, okay, ow, hit my head. But how this was like our new favorite mini golf course of all time. This helps top it right here. That's for sure. Oh, there's a little black hat. You got no white yeah, shoes. There's another one down there. Aw. Hi, kitty. Um, hey, kitty. All right, well, now that we're down from the Easter Island head. Okay, so the, the next hole is the T Rex. This is actually under construction right now, but they just happen to have this side open. So we're going to pass this hole, and at the end, what we'll do is we'll do like, I'll ask like Sirius, I'm like picking a number between 1 and 18, and we'll do that hole for the 10th hole at the very end. It's kind of like it's the 18th hole, but not 18th hole. But it's nice that this side is actually open even though that hole is still being worked on. But we're gonna now carry on to hole 11. All right, so hole, whoa, this looks cool. So you gotta hit it hard enough to flip it into that pipe. And then it goes into that and rolls out. That is awesome. I'll see how this works. Oh, I didn't think that was hard enough. Yeah. Oh! Yeah, let's go. Do it, girl. Ha, it like rolled all around. Oh, right over it. Of course. Oh my gosh. Sweet. All right, next up, oh, we got the spider hole up next. And the hole is underneath the spider that's moving. That is awesome. <laughs> you ready to face your fears? So close. No way. <laughs> Wise decision on my part. That was smart of you leaving that there. That was smart. Hole in one for Alicia. And there it is. Okay, so this looks cool. So you can launch it. I guess you can launch it into the toilet. Or if not, it comes out the, like, just the trough in front. Yeah, that's cool. So you can literally like send that flying. Well, this is going to be a schwack it. I think I'm going to hit mine down. Yeah. Well, here, we'll go ahead and, uh, well, let's see if I can, like, oh, whoa. And then it still came out the bottom one. <laughs> hey, buddy, I wasn't even trying to do that. You were trying to hit in the bottom. And here comes Alicia. You got a little bit farther. I'm at the play. I guess this must be an outhouse, I suppose. Oh, that was close. Oh, here, I'll go ahead and. So that was four. Is that it? I will Very play. nice shot. That was fantastic. All right, what we got for hole 14? We got the octopus. I say we both just hit it. And we'll see afterwards where the balls come out. I'm on this one. Yes, you're first. We'll just see which one it goes for. That is a very angry looking octopus, by the way. Yours went down. I guess I'm going to that right one. side. 
I don't know how long it takes for him to come out. I got a hole in one. Oh my gosh, he <laughs> did. Well, I'm gonna go for the right side then. That works for me. I guess they all just come straight out. Well, I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i go down here and I'll try to get down the right one. I'm gonna try to get the right side. Mine is going middle. Slowly. Come on. Ah. Oh. It turned it was, a little bit. In it was right by it. Like, look at how yours, like, I don't know. That's crazy. Pop two for me. I aimed for the right side, too, and it, like, hit it, and then rolled back over to the middle. By the way, guys, for anyone wondering, mini golf scorecard. I keep the scores on my phone. Makes it a lot easier than having to carry around a pencil, especially with filming. Love it a lot. All right, what we got next? Oh, we got, I guess, some kind of lizard. There are one, two, three, four different holes. Four options. One comes out here. I see one hole over here. So one comes out right there. Where? Right here. And I have no idea where the other three come out. So there's one option there. And then I guess all the other ones are out of his mouth? It's gotta be. Well, I go first, I'll find out. I'm just gonna aim for the middle and hope for the best. Or the side. I can feel it. it's gonna come out right there. Okay, so I'm guessing the sides are bad and the middle ones are good. That's my guess. Elisha is, okay. Well, I guess it's gonna come out the mouth. Nope, no way. Oh, so close. Still great though. Sorry, Mr. Lizard Man, I'm on your foot. Please, whoo, I will take that, all right. Okay, I'm curious about this one. Wait, there's a hole up. Gonna come up. You have to hit it hard enough to come up there and the hole's right there. That's cool. Well, oh, there it comes. Will it? No. I'm okay with it. Still good though. This is definitely a schwack it. Come on. Hello. Right <laughs> Two for me. All right. Okay, this is gonna be a little bit of a challenge. You're gonna have to really time that well. And by you, I mean me, because I go first, don't I? Well, we'll find out. That's what I figured. Well, mine's gonna sit right there. Can she, get oh, she barely got it. It came out over here in the corner. I think it like clipped it when it went under. I wow. Made it, but I made it. All right, now I gotta figure out, uh, I gotta get mine under still. This is like really trippy trying to time this. I thought it wasn't gonna make it. Come on. Oh, that was completely blind too. I had no idea where the hole was. Oh. And a three for me. All right, so now that we're technically at hole 18, we gotta go back and figure out hole number 10. So here's what we're gonna do. Hey Siri, pick a number between one and 17. Of course it picked that one. It picked 10, which is the hole that we can't do. Let's try again. Pick a number between one and 17. 14. I guess, was that the octopus? I guess we're doing the octopus hole again. Oh, wow. Okay, we'll go back to that one. That's gonna be our hole number 10. See which one she gets. Yeah, well, Far. we'll find out what the left side is. Left. Still not bad. All right, I'll let you guys know which one mine comes down. Right side. Come on, that one worked for Alicia before. Wow. I got a lucky roll. You got a really lucky roll out on that, man. Two for Alicia, and a two for me. All right, here we go, last hole. And it says if you get it in the snake's mouth, you get a free game. So, oh wow, that is not easy. Oh boy. So if you somehow manage, I don't know if you guys can even see that, let me try to zoom in. If you can manage to go up that tiny path in the snake's mouth, you get a free game. And that'll be a hole in one, and if it doesn't, it just goes in the back, it'll be a two. Well, I'm first, so let's see if I can get up that tiny little path. That is crazy. 
Yep, two for me. Oh, two's for both of us. Are you ready for the final scores? Sure. I figured if we're gonna do this, you gotta do it in front of the giant dragon mouth right here at the entrance. You got 40, okay. I got 41. It was such a close game. It was such a close game. Close. I honestly don't know which side I like more. I don't either. I have no idea. That was so much fun. I think I actually like the whole thing. Just like just the whole vibe of it, yeah. Like I don't have a favorite side. This is definitely, I still think, our new favorite mini golf course. This is amazing. If you're ever in Panama City Beach, Florida, you've got to check this place out. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Hopefully you enjoyed this course. Again, if you're in the area, you've got to check this place out. It's awesome. Maybe we'll come back and play this side at night. We'll see. But love you, definitely let me know. I'm so excited I can't talk right now. What you guys thought in the comments down below. But if you're new around here, guys, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, click that bell next to it to upload videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you all very soon in the next video. Later. So one of the workers here just gave us like a cool little like history lesson of this place. So again, I said in the other video, I don't think I said in this one, it's been here since 59. So almost 60 years, like 56 years. And check this out. This building right here is the house of the people that built this place. They literally built it on their property, built this entire course back in 59. And then this postcard right here is from sometime after it opened. And that's the beach running all the way up right here. So the beach used to come all the way up before any of this road existed. You just pulled up on the beach and then this would all just be sand right here. That is so awesome. That's like a really cool like history lesson to a place that's been around for like half a decade or half a millen millen century. That's the word. Half a century. That's really, really cool. This is, such a, this is a really fun place. This is awesome. Seriously, recommend checking it out if you're in the area. So we were just told that this dinosaur right here, which is from Course 2, the side we played in the first video, you can actually go inside it and sign it. So the worker here gave us a Sharpie and we're gonna go in here and we're gonna sign inside this dinosaur, which I did not know was here before. Oh, wow. All right, so hopefully this guy just helps you a little bit. We gotta find a spot to, uh, we gotta, like, find a spot to sign it. All right, guys, here's where I'm gonna sign it, right here. So, the name right there, I'll sign it way up. So, B, H, D, L, T. There it is, right there, guys. We have officially marked our place inside this dinosaur. That is awesome. There's Alicia's. Very nice. So guys, if you come in, stepping inside the dinosaur, you come up right after you go past this wall. My name is right up there. Alicia's name right there. Very nice. Let me know if you guys have ever signed the wall in here yourselves. This is so cool.